a Web3 MPC solution. Well, today I'm super excited to be talking about this next product called Cypher BC. But before we do that, make sure to do research, figure out this project is for you. So Cypher BC is a company that provides asset management service utilizing MPC technology, which I'll talk about today, kind of show uh, you guys what that means. Uh, and we talk about a lot of different acronyms, so I'll try to define those as we go on. Uh, but they're trying to create the safest environment for their clients. And we're going to focus on Cypher BC Flexify, which is their latest launch of their product. Right now, Cypher BC is 1.2.0, which has both a mobile and a desktop version. Uh, so that's definitely exciting. Definitely, we're going to cover as much as we can today. So in case you guys didn't know, MPC stands for Multi-Party Computation. And I'll be mentioning that acronym throughout the video. Um, and here's some of the reasons why it's even better than multi-sign-in wallets. So they've introduced a new concept into the wallet space called WAAS. And you're probably familiar with the term software service, but WAAS is wallet as a service. Um, so this project is cross-platform, multi-cloud, SaaS solution running in a trusted environment uh, based off MPC CMP protocol. And there's just a ton of different benefits, improved performance, security, and overall flexibility. They're using a well-known process to make key generation processes seamless. It's multi-cloud, so it lets you have private keys be held with them, so you don't have to worry about access being lost. It just has a lot of flexibility. Like I mentioned, it's available on mobile or PC. So for them, security is number one. Anytime you're dealing with wallets, making sure that when they're uh, taking care of your assets, they want to make sure that it's safe and secure. And they have the team and the knowledge to make sure that everything that they do, security is always at the forefront of that. Uh, I think another focus that they have is being able to utilize it wherever you go, obviously uh, making it easily accessible. So that's why they focused on uh, the mobile app and that mobile version. We'll show them uh, what that looks like in a bit. Um, basically letting you do everything you need to do if you're out in the world. I know there's a lot of different countries out there that this is super crucial for their businesses that maybe don't have a desktop computer but having a mobile just kind of expands the reach that this project has so I think one big focus of that is making sure that all businesses no matter the location but also uh, their size of them they want to make products that you know really help out everyone so if they want to create this wall that every small business can use sometimes there's rising project startups that really you know don't have the budget uh, to push to web3 uh, but they want to make sure that they can help them support them uh, as well so they want to make a cheaper compatible price creating a secure environment for all. And I think that's very honorable of them to do. And it's a smart business move. Uh, they have a wide range of partners who are really utilizing this. Um, so again, we'll check out some of that information uh, later on in the video. Today, I'm gonna walk you guys through how to register, how to join teams, make transactions. They definitely had a huge focus on the UI and kind of the, the process to get through um, doing all these different things. So that's awesome. We'll talk about different wallets, uh, check out um, how you can, if you have different projects, uh, how you could work um, within that. Uh, and then we'll also see how it works with other DeFi platforms as well. So the MPC is a keyless system that replaces the private key with individual key shares, separately generate multi-zero trusting partners without sharing any data. So besides the MPC as a top layer of security, they also use other things like biometric verification, uh, trusted execution environment, uh, such as SGX and Trust Zone, together with top tier AML risk control system in the industry, again, focus for them is security of your funds and they make that as the forefront of everything that they do uh, but let's jump into uh, some details we'll go over some of the stuff on their website I'll show you guys uh, what this looks like the company is based in Dubai with eight years of crypto asset management experience uh, they launched a brand new DOP with diverse functions and they upgraded their desktop version uh, they're gonna help businesses of all size manage digital assets um, which I think is really great no matter the size of that company they want to make sure that they have access to everything they can offer um, they really support the openness and free spirit of web3 literally for everyone they want to make sure even the smallest startups are able to succeed unlike similar products tailored for large enterprises they cater products of all sizes such as financial institutions small businesses such as web3 project owners and they want to make it easy and accessible for everyone so we're going to go over how to sign up uh, with this MC wallet for business enter some information. This is just test information uh, For you guys to say sign up 
Uh, welcome to the wallet team management. Enter a team name, so whatever you choose. Local MC unit is being generated, so it just takes a couple of seconds uh, to do that. Um, so really quick, wallet's created. Uh, and then obviously, the first thing you want to do is you want to back it up. Uh, again, it's member security is number one. Uh, you confirm your phrase. And again, this is just a test count, but shows you could have different teams uh, within it. So there's a bunch of things you could do. Create new teams, join existing ones, uh, do efficient asset management, uh, easily switch between teams. You saw in the UI that you could easily do that. Um, ensure all activities are under control. Enhance operational efficiencies as well. Customizable approval workflows. You could set different layers of approval uh, depending on what your business needs. Uh, and then of course, like there's going to be some times when businesses might need different approval processes depending on finance or HR. So that's available. Um, you could also make transactions. So select the network first and the tokens. Um, there's 70 plus chains to so far and there's going to be more that's going to be added. Um, so you could put in the information in the wallet. Uh, you could customize your gas fee and then confirm to hit send. They have an elaborate approval center um, so you can easily track all your transactions, uh, really like you know specify how you want this to be done. You could choose applicants, filter out specific date or certain periods uh, depending on the approval status. Uh, and then you can also focus on different types of transactions. Now we're at the approval flow setting section. Here you can select specific team members as approvers. And through the RAFP process, users can be designated admins or whatever different layers of approval based off your company needs. Maybe they're part of the finance team or the HR team and they have a different approval process. Check out some Web3 integrations. You can interact with DeFi platforms, DEXs, and other decentralized applications. And again, they have all the security um, features that go into this. They definitely want to make sure that you feel safe and your team feels safe um, utilizing their platform. So the Flexify is the latest launch of their product. Um, again, if you guys want to check it out, uh, definitely do so. I'll put the link in the description so you guys can check this out uh, for yourself. So you could download this on the Google Play Store, the iOS Store, or you could check it out on Windows or Mac. If you guys are interested, definitely follow them on their socials. I'll put the link in the description. They definitely do some great updates, uh, obviously talking about some of the latest features, uh, but definitely check it out tons of information on there uh, that would be helpful for you guys to kind of dig into what they're doing, uh, not only now, but in the future. Here's my website at cypherbc.com. I'll put the link in the description so you guys to check it out for yourself. Uh, and we're not going to go too much into this, but I did want to show you guys uh, some information. Obviously, you can learn more about their security and the things that they, they do there, which I think is actually super valuable and important. They talk about the MPC Wallet Suite for you guys to check out. Obviously, it's for managing the virtual assets. They have a wide diversity of modes, including custody, co-custody, and self-custody. So that's obviously um, super important. Uh, and then obviously they talk about their different payment solutions as well. Um, here are some of the reasons why I think this project stands out. Technical leader, so MPC, which we talked about, TEE plus zero trust, regulatory compliance, open source plus security, certified plus licenses, and it's just a complete product. You can do everything you need to do uh, that you want to, literally a one-stop solution. So I think that's important. Um, but again, take a deeper dive into this. If you guys are interested, look at these milestone numbers. Look, over 100 million wallets have been created, over 15 billion transaction volume. They've been doing this for a while and they know what they're doing and a lot of people trust in everything that they do. And so you should definitely check it out as well. You could actually check out specific licenses and certifications that they do have. And I thought this area was really important, the different client types. Remember we talked about helping, they are looking to help support business of different sizes and revenue. Um, and these are uh, really goes to show uh, what the different types of projects that they work with. So if you guys are interested, they have a great academy to kind of learn more. I'll put the link in the description. Um, but again, Cypher BC, a lot of great stuff going on. So that's Cypher BC, definitely a project that I'm interested in. I'll definitely keep you guys updated on the latest developments. Thanks for watching. Catch you guys next time.